Good morning, this is Jeff with Sewer Tech Northwest. Today we're at property address 21781 Southwest Berkshire Terrace here in Sherwood. Located at the back of the house where the garage is at. We're straight out from the garage and the driveway. We have a three inch ABS clean out. And insert the camera and check the overall condition and serviceability of the sanitary sewer line. We have water running, off we go. We switch over to 4 inch 3034 here. And then we've reached the main here at 24 feet. We're going to locate that while the line drains, then we'll flip the camera around and run it backwards underneath the uh, garage floor back to the foundation wall. Line terminates at the main here at the back where the driveway goes out to. It's kind of the back alleyway. All right, we're going to reverse the camera and run it backwards towards the house. Everything from the clean out to the main lateral connection is in fantastic condition, has great flow, and is functioning properly at this time. An overall fairly clean sewer line. You got a little, that tan stuff is a little bit of grease. It's, it's not major. Now, this junk my camera scraping loose looks like, like wipes. Do not put them down your sewer line. They don't travel through very well. The flushable wipes are they're as bad as paper towels are. And right here is where we cross back into the crawl space area. <clears throat> it looks like we have some standing water under the floor of the garage. We'll see that here in just a second. At least it appeared to. I think my camera may also have been scraping a bunch of junk off the pipe and damming the pipe up in front of the camera. You do have some standing water here. It looks like it dissipates out around 16 feet. And you've got some fairly good grease buildup. That stuff's going all the way up, oh, to the, almost to the top of the pipe there. I am going to recommend you do some drain cleaning. That's That debris is, is about two inches high. <clears throat> and most of that is looks like a combination of grease and wipes, as far as I can tell. The standing water is, so far here, very minor. You've only got about a 16th to a quarter inch of standing water here which in my opinion is not repair worthy. Um, and by and large, the only stuff that's going to collect in this is this kind of junk, stuff that shouldn't be going down the sewer line. <clears throat> I do recommend some drain cleaning to clear that out of the sewer line, uh, but I do not recommend any repairs to correct the standing water. I don't really get concerned about bellies until you've got inches of standing water for an extended period of time. Um, with this amount of standing water, it's not that it couldn't cause a blockage, but if you're blocking up, it's because of what you're putting down the sewer line. It's not because of that belly. <clears throat> The belly extends here from about 3 feet to 16 feet going back into the house. And overall, it has about a quarter inch maximum of standing water here. Now we're going to reel the camera out. recommend drain cleaning back into the interior to knock that stuff loose. Aside from that, the line itself <clears throat> has good flow. It's all in good condition. 
and is functioning at this time, it will have better flow and function more properly once the line has been cleaned.